Welcome back to The Breakdown with Luke. Today we're going to be taking a look at Anchor's very budget-friendly 20-watt USB and USB-C charger. This will charge two devices at once. Now, it is a budget device that Anchor has out there, primarily targeting iPhone 15s, but will work with a wide range of devices. We're going to break down the pros and cons. Also break down a few things you should can really consider before buying this. But it's a very nice budget um, plug that comes with a lot. Let's dive into it. First of all, a few quick things. This was not a review unit. I did buy it with my own money to review for you. Keep that in mind. Second, pricing on this changes so rapidly. I hate to give you a price and have it be wrong. I'll put a link to it on the show notes and in the first pin comment down below to it on Amazon. And lastly, if you like what we do, please consider either hitting that subscribe button or hitting that thumbs up. Doing one or both lets YouTube know you enjoy what we do here. With that said, let's dive in here and take a look at the plug itself. Priest Air Plug, it is not a foldable prong. This is a fixed one, so if that's important to you, keep that in mind. You do have a standard USB and a USB-C with this. Beyond that, not a whole lot to say. It does have a little Anchor logo here. I do like it's subtle. I, sometimes you get plugs that are big, bright, bold logo colors. I like how this one's kind of subtle and blends in there. Let's take a look at everything that came with this and break down more. Now, right off the bat, it's a budget-friendly but device, but comes with a lot for the price. Two very nice long um, USB-C cables, two USB-C and USB wall plugs for the price. Very nice. Now it is 20 watts. Now 20 watts plugged into a single device will fast charge and max charge many devices, including a Nintendo Switch and more. But it's 20 watts max out, which means if you divide it by two, right, plug two devices, you're not getting the full 20 watts and you're not rapid charging or max um, a iPhone 15 or and you're not max charging a Nintendo Switch and other devices. Well, this is heavily marketed as targeting the iPhone 15 standard because the iPhone 15 standard is a 20 watt device. It does work with pretty much all USB. It does work with all USB-C devices. Just the question is, you know, is it enough to max charge your device? Now, do remember the iPhone 15 Max is like 27 watts. Somebody correct me if I got that number wrong. I'm doing it off the top of my head. So this won't max charge an iPhone 15 Max, but will rapid charge. Now, a few things right off the bat. Max charging only really matters if you're desperate to get the fastest charge possible. If you're putting this by your bed and you know you're going to plug this into your um, phone and have it charge overnight, you don't get that charge overnight without problem. This will charge your phone overnight, no problem. They advertise that with the 20 watts in here for standard iPhone 15, you can go from zero to about 55% in 30 minutes. It seems to be about reasonable. Overall, it's a very nice charger for the price. You know, these are great chargers. Let me be honest, I have a preteen daughter who has multiple electronic devices and always seems to be misplacing the chargers. Anybody have kids that just seem to eat chargers? They're left at a friend's house, they're left at an event, they're left at grandpa and grandma's, and you're losing them. And that's, I think this is why these kind of plugs are great. They're so cheap that if they're gone, I don't care. I didn't just spend 40, 50 bucks on a high powered, you know, 80 plus watt, 67 watt, whatever it may be, wall charger. It's pretty good. Now, again, when you plug in multiple devices, it will give you a slower charge, but it's a lot cheaper, especially when you look at per charger, than a lot of the more expensive 67, 45 watts and higher type chargers from Anchor. So I'm gonna give this two thumbs up. Everything worked as it should. In our testing, it charged as we would expect for a wide range of devices, an iPad, uh, Pixel uh, 8 Pro, Nintendo Switch, wireless earbuds, and more without problem was very, very pleased with the quality of it. And of course, as always with anchors, they seem to be well made. So I will put a link to this on the show notes and in the first pin comment, just keep in mind, it doesn't have a foldable prong. It is a 20 watt max out, which will max charge most phones, but a few like the new iPhone 15 Pro Max will give it a rapid charge, but not a max charge. If you plug in two devices, you probably won't even get a rapid charge with it. You'll get a standard rate charge, which isn't bad. So just keep those key points in mind, and I think you'll like this. If you like what we do, hit that subscribe button. We would really appreciate it. And until next time, take care, be safe. We'll be back again real soon with another review.